According to one local candy store, Easter is one of their best-selling holidays. I'm Caitlin Holt, and I asked them if rising cocoa prices have had an effect on their business. I've been in this business pretty much my whole life. Blake Berenson says they go through more than 5,000 pounds of milk chocolate each Easter season. He says the increase in cocoa prices stems from a bad crop. They're calling for like a 28 to 40 percent increase. I, we'll see when we, we get there, really. He says some of their specialty chocolates have gone up about a dollar a pound, but the rising cocoa prices don't necessarily have him nervous. The chocolate that we use in bulk, we're contracted for pretty much a year, so we won't really see the price increases till November, end of November, start of December. According to CNBC, prices of Cocoa Futures contract for May deliveries of this year have reached an all-time high. Blake says the fluctuation is normal, and he's seen it before. Ann Smith, a customer at Beer & Sins, says if there were to be a price hike, she would make some changes. I would be like a little more lean in the Easter baskets as far as like the chocolates and look for chocolate alternatives, um, either candy or little toys. But supporting local businesses is important to her. I like this place. Like I come here for all the holidays. Um, it's just it's it's good chocolate and it's something, you know, a little special. Molly and Julia Gatowski say a price rise wouldn't stop them from purchasing chocolate. Not for special occasions and special treats. I think every once in a while we deserve a, a little extra treat, right? Yeah. Especially not when they can get chocolate covered Oreos. With how good it is, it, it makes sense. Between personalized fudge eggs and solid chocolate bunnies, Blake says he doesn't think chocolate consumers need to fear the rising cocoa prices. Easter is a very chocolate holiday. Right. <laughs> Come get some chocolate, yeah. Beer and Sins are usually open every day if you have to fulfill some last minute chocolate needs. In Green Bay, Caitlin Holt, NBC 26.